Africa Rise Improving Food Security Information in Africa For the Sub-Saharan African countries to fully achieve their potential for rice production it is critical to have adequate and reliable information on their rice economies to help formulate appropriate strategies and policies. Africa Rice launched an initiative in December 2007 as part of the Japan Africa Rice Emergency Rice Initiative, which was designed to improve the timely availability, reliability, and relevance of rice statistics and information needed for quality rice research, evidence-based policy formulation, and monitoring and evaluation of rice-related investments in sub-Saharan Africa. The initiative was implemented in collaboration with the National Agricultural Research Systems, the National Agricultural Statistics Services, the African Development Bank, AgriMet, and other regional stakeholders. The project worked with the National Agricultural Research Systems and the National Agricultural Statistics Services in 21 member countries of the Coalition for African Rice Development, CARD. Building on the success of that project, a new three-year project has been launched with financial and technical support from Japan's Ministry of Agriculture, Forestry, and Fisheries to improve the food security information system in Africa through the generation of quality rice data and information. Dr. Kenja Kamikura, who is a senior statistician at the Statistics Department of Ministry of Agriculture, Forestry, and Fisheries of Japan observed. Uh, concerning the importance of the rice food security in Africa region, Japan has uh, recognized the need to strengthen the capacity of statistics in this region. No? Africa region imports lots of rice uh, from the world, which accounts about 30 percentage of global uh, rice trade. Okay. The information of rice in this region is affecting not only the global supply and demand situation of rice, but also uh, the food security policies across the globe. This will add value to the existing endeavors undertaken so far towards the goal of improving the availability and reliability of rice statistics in support of the objective of the CARD initiative. Economist from Yeranga Agricultural Research Institute, Tanzania, Dr. A. Raisha Martinum Kenya said. We have started the data collection already in Kahama Hub. And if, so far we have done uh, the village module because the questionnaire has a, 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 a almost five, five module, five module. We have done <coughs> one module of the village questionnaire in all 35, 32 villages. And we have gone further because <coughs> the, because we are using this, the MLAX application, and it have, it has been divided into rounds. So the village model and some part of the producer model is in the, the first round. So we have done the village mod module, we have completed for 32 village. And we have done also the individual interview for the farmers for the first round. And we have done about 80% of the second round. That is also the, uh, for core producers for agronomy, for CD training. Head of Planning and Agriculture Economist from National Cereals Research Institute, Nigeria, Dr. Vivian Ojinomo commented. Doing survey takes a lot of money, involves a lot of money. But I thank God that right now the situation has improved tremendously. And since this administration came upon, came on board, I think we, the economic tax force has been given a prominent place. Uh, from by my own observation, it seems as if, in fact, it's the economic tax force that is vibrant. The project will consist mainly of three main activities relating to, one, the development of a survey methodology to be used to conduct rice surveys in the participating countries, 
2. National Agricultural Research Systems Capacity Building to acquire the required skills to implement rice surveys using the method that will be introduced by the project. 3. Conduct surveys in selected countries. Africa Rice Afad Project Coordinator Dr. Ali Thuray summarized. This project mainly will build on, uh, will uh, try to reinforce the uh, capacity of NARS uh, partners and also try to improve on the way of we are collecting data, especially data on area and uh, yield. This uh, new uh, methodology that has, that has been uh, taught to the partners will uh, be uh, tested in three pilot countries. And uh, something I would like to mention also, uh, here it's a group of stati statisticians and economists. Economists, uh, like uh, yesterday, they focused on the progress uh, report on uh, active baseline data collection in the herbs, and uh, statisticians have discussed among themselves also to see uh, the, um, how well they can uh, um, they can use this new uh, system in addition to what they have as already existing system in the countries in order to continue uh, collecting uh, all these data, which are very useful data for uh, food security purposes, for policy formulation policy uh, purposes. For more information, visit www.africarise.org.